What's good? What's good, everyone? It's Young Wino, the rookie chef, and I'm back with another one, y'all. We're going to be doing a healthy one, very fast, fun, and uh, yummy for your tummy, okay? This time, we are going to be doing a spicy vegan vegetable spaghetti. That's right. Spicy vegan vegetable spaghetti. It ain't going to be nothing meat about it. All plant-based, everything we use. All right? Plant-based or plant itself. Okay? This is going to be some yummy good goodness. We even got some sausages that are plant-based. That's going to be going into this vegan yummy goodness spaghetti. All right? Are y'all ready to get this party started so I can show you what we working with? All right. Let's go. Let's handle our business. Let's make this come to life. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Y'all, let me show you what we working with for our spicy vegan vegetable spaghetti. Check it out. Star the show here. Look at this, y'all. We got some spicy Mexican chipotle sausage. Oh, no. Not just any sausage. Plant-based sausage. This is made out of pure plant. There ain't nothing meaty about it. This is going to be so good in our vegan spaghetti, y'all. There you go. Spicy Mexican chipotle plant-based sausage right there. We got a red chili pepper, we got a tomato, we got a jalapeno pepper, we got a piece of green bell pepper, we got yellow bell pepper, what I had left over. We got some okra that I had left over. We got some green onion, we got some fresh kale. We got some ground red pepper, we got some smoked sea salt, we got some Cajun seasoning, which is definitely, definitely vegan friendly. All them good vegetables in there, okay? And we got some traditional style pasta sauce. Doesn't contain no meat. It's not meat sauce, doesn't contain no creaminess for dairy. This is just regular traditional pasta sauce, which is vegan friendly and actually plant-based, okay? And over here, our spaghetti, we got the red lentil spaghetti, which is, you guessed it, plant-based spaghetti, y'all. This is plant-based spaghetti made out of lentil, red lentil, okay? All right, y'all. So there y'all have it right there for this yummy goodness. All right, all my healthy people, especially my vegan friends out there. Let's have some fun. Let's go. First, let's start getting our vegetables cut up, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and uh, start with my okra. This is a very big, big okra, y'all, that I had, okay? So you know how I do it. I cut the tip off, I cut the kneecap off. I call this the kneecap right here, okay? And basically what we're gonna do, just gonna cut it up small and round just like that, okay? Well, that's not a complete round. Let me show y'all again. <laughs> Just like that, okay? All right, let's keep it moving. Just like that, let's go. Red pepper, red chili pepper, y'all already know. This is basically gonna be cut down into round little pieces too. All right, let's keep it moving. Like that, let's go. Bam, like that. And there's a jalapeno right there. I just went on and cut it up real quick too, okay? We got the okra, red chili pepper, jalapeno pepper. Let's keep it moving. Now the bell pepper, let's go. Pepper we just go on. That's all we're gonna do. Chop a bone up like that. Let's keep it moving. Let's go. There's the green bell pepper right there. Let's get to the yellow. Let's go. Bam. Got the yellow bell pepper with it. Okay, let's get that tomato going. Let's go. Bam. Just like that. There go that tomato. Let's go. Green onions. You know, I just keep them in the bundle just like this. Put them all together. And I just basically cut them down like that. So they'll be perfect little pieces. Let's keep it moving. And there y'all have it. You just need a little bit of green onion. You don't need a lot, okay? You don't need a lot. Now, here's uh, some of my kale. Cut some of that up, and we're gonna keep it moving. Let's go. I'm just gonna take my kale after I rinse them off, cut them off the little stem. Just gonna roll it up like that. Basically, I'm just gonna cut it up just like that. Let's go. Don't this look beautiful? Don't this look beautiful, y'all? Look at that. Got our kale, green onions, tomato, Yellow bell pepper, green bell pepper, jalapeno, red chili pepper, and okra. Man, that's good. Some good vegan yummy goodness. Nothing but the best of the earth right here. Okay, let's go ahead and get that plant-based sausage cut up. Let's go. Here's our plant-based chipotle sausage, okay? Made out of plant. I just took one off, so we're gonna do Cut in it, you know, gonna cut into them just like that. Just like I would do my hot links, okay? Let me get them cut up, we're gonna keep it moving. 
You want to take the casings, the casings from around the uh, plant-based sausage, okay? And this is what they look like when I cut them all up. Yummy goodness, huh? All that red juice and stuff you see there, that's just the vegetable. I mean, this is plant-based sausage, so that's all the vegetable, the juice that you see right there, okay? But they're all cut up and ready to go. Now, let's get this party started. Let's go. All right, y'all, so I got the olive oil in here. You can see over here the water is boiling. For our spaghetti, that ain't gonna take long because it's uh, plant-based spaghetti, red lentil. That's gonna cook fast in this hot water, okay? But for now, we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna take all our yummy vegetables, go ahead and put it in this olive oil, get them kind of nice and stirred up. Then we're gonna put the plant-based sausage in uh, afterwards, okay? So, I'm gonna go ahead and get all this yummy goodness in here, and uh, we're gonna keep it moving. Let's go. Once we got all this yummy goodness in there, Go ahead and get your spatula or your wooden spoon, whatever you're going to use. And go ahead and just saute it up in that olive oil. Okay? Just like that. It's looking so pretty. Look, don't that look so pretty? Look at that. It's looking so pretty, ain't it? So that's all you want to do. Just want to get that all sauteed up and going, okay? We're going to keep it moving. Let's go. Yeah, what we want to do right now is come on in with our seasonings. After we kind of saute this up a little bit in the olive oil, we got our Cajun seasoning right here. Put that in there, you know. About a teaspoon, smoked, uh, we got our smoked sea salt. You don't have to put no regular salt because the Cajun seasoning is already, already has this portion. So with the smoke, I'm just gonna put a little, maybe just a half a teaspoon. I just want that smoked sea salt taste, that's all. And then of course, my ground red pepper because y'all know me. All right, so you're gonna get that in there, about a teaspoon. Okay, then you're gonna go ahead, start giving it another little mix up with those seasonings. And we about to put the uh, red lentil plant-based spaghetti in there. Let's go. All right, y'all. Here's our red lentil plant-based spaghetti right here. I'm not going to break it up. I'm just going to set it in. Pop just like that and let it go ahead and cook down on its own, okay? Let's keep it moving. All right, y'all. So while the red lentil is cooking over there, I'm going to turn it down to medium a little bit and let that cook. We're going to go ahead and get our plant-based chipotle uh, sausages on in here with everything else. Pour that old yummy goodness in there, y'all. Can y'all believe this is a plant? They did a good job when they made this, you know. So once you got our plant-based chipotle sausages in there, go ahead and lightly start mixing them on in. Because they don't need to cook long because they're not meat. All right, oh man, this is gonna be some good vegan spaghetti. I'm telling y'all, I'm telling y'all that already. Just look at this. This is going to be some good vegan spicy spaghetti dish, though. What y'all think? Not a drop of meat, not a drop of dairy, not a drop of eggs in this. All plant-based. Let's go. So, the lentil spaghetti is done. So, what I'm simply going to do, y'all can see it right here. Y'all see that? So, what I'm simply going to do is take a nice little big one like here. I'm not going to strain it or none of that. I'm just going to put it on over into my skillet. Just going to do just like this. Put it on in there just like that, okay? You get to stir it up, and we're going to keep it moving. All right, y'all, it is done. Now, I don't know about y'all, but this is some yummy, goodness, spicy, vegan, vegetable uh, spaghetti, y'all. Look at how I look in this pot. Look at, look at this. Look at this, y'all. Look how beautiful that looks. And look at them, look at them plant-based sausages. Uh, look at all this yummy goodness. Now that's a damn good vegan spaghetti dish right here, y'all. Okay? We already there, okay? We about to get the plating going, and we about to turn this into life. Let's go. All right, y'all, it is done. Oh man, it's some yummy goodness, y'all. Introducing spicy vegan vegetable spaghetti, the Rookie Chef way. All right, check it out. I bet y'all wasn't expecting that, was y'all? No, no, y'all wasn't expecting that. Look at that, y'all. And you know what, y'all? I decided not to use the traditional spaghetti sauce over there. You know why? Because look how beautiful this looks. I didn't think it was necessary to use it, so I decided to keep it out because this looks fire, yummy goodness. This is all vegan plant-based, y'all. This whole dish, this whole dish is plant-based. Nothing with meat, milk, or dairy, or anything is made with this. So I hope my vegan friends will love the outcome of this. It's so beautiful. Now, if y'all want to use spaghetti sauce, you can use it. I just decided not to when I saw the outcome. Oh my God, y'all look at this. Y'all look at that yummy goodness. Look at that yummy goodness, y'all. 
We got that plant-based sausage in there, that Chipotle sausage. And I'm not gonna lie, I tasted one, y'all. You can't even tell the difference. It is so good. We got those red lentil spaghettis in there, which is also plant-based. We got all those peppers we cut up in there. We got the green onion. We got the okra in there. You know, with the jalapeno, the red pepper, the bell pepper and the yellow bell pepper. Oh man, y'all, this is it right here. Spicy vegan vegetable spaghetti. Plant-based sausage, y'all. Chipotle sausage right there. All made of that yummy, healthy goodness, okay? There it is there. There it is there. Yes, indeed, y'all. Yes, indeed. Mm-hmm. All right. All right, all right, all right. The taste test. All right, y'all, here we go. Let me let y'all take a close-up. Y'all know how I do it. Man, look at that. Y'all see, we didn't need, we didn't need to put that, uh, that spaghetti sauce on here. We didn't have to put that pasta sauce on here. I like it just the way it is, okay? I will use that pasta sauce for something different, for some uh, traditional spaghetti that I'll do next time, okay? But for this vegan yumminess, we leaving it all plant-based with no sauce, okay? There y'all have it right there. Let's go ahead and dig on in. Take one of these sausages. Look at that, y'all. Just can't believe that's a plant, huh? Look like real meat, I'm telling you. Go ahead and get some yummy goodness. Oh yeah, look at that, y'all. Oh man, it's falling apart. Look at that, y'all. Look at that yummy goodness. Do y'all see that yummy goodness? Look. Look at that. Let's go in. Look here. Look here. Mm. Refreshing. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Y'all ever go get this? Make sure you find one the Chipotle pepper flavor. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Amazing. Mm, and the peppers are going good, good with this. That's a really good plant-based sausage, y'all. That's my first time even having that. When I decided to do a vegan spaghetti dish, I saw the regular other, just the regular plant-based sausage, but the one that had the chipotle, because we made this spicy. We call this spicy. And them sausages are spicy, okay? They made with actually they made with red uh, with red chili peppers, believe it or not, and onion and all other kind of plants. I was reading on that pack. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. And the lentil spaghetti, mm, it just tastes healthy, y'all. Oh my goodness! And for me, you know, to my vegans. Vegetarians and everybody, you'll probably have you some vegetable juice with this or a vegetable cocktail, which is fine. But for me, it's always got to be a cold one. All right, y'all, this is where we dim the lights and say our goodbyes. Oh, man, I can't believe that is not real sausage. I don't know how they do it. I don't know how they did it, okay? They could have fooled me. If they would have brought that to me and told me it was real Chipotle sausage, real meat, I wouldn't have argued with them. But man, it's amazing what they can do with plants, right? You know, the environment is beautiful, all right? Here's another recap real quick on what we did. We did a spicy vegan vegetable spaghetti, y'all, with plant paste Chipotle sausage. There it is right there again, y'all. It's fire, it's good, I'm very impressed. And the, the peppers and the vegetables that we cut up with this, the kale, don't forget y'all, we got kale in here too. We got all that healthy goodness in here. And I'm gonna tell you like this, I feel really refreshed eating this, okay? I got a sense of healthiness 
in my mind when I'm eating this because this is very, very, very good. Y'all should give it a try. Give it a try, y'all. It is yummy goodness. And you can use uh, the traditional spaghetti sauce if you want. The spaghetti sauce is vegan friendly. It is plant-based, but for me, I had to put a different twist. When it came out like this, I said, we're not going to have a spaghetti sauce. We're going to leave it just like this. All right? Just like that. With a cold one for me. All right, I want to thank y'all for joining me on another Rookie Chef Adventure, y'all. This is good. I'm about to take it down. Uh, hope everybody's having a beautiful start of the weekend. May you have a fully weekend uh, that's going to be beneficial to you and your health and your family and your friends and everything else, okay? I'm getting ready to take this down. Next time you see me, we'll be doing our highlighting our cold chefs. I already got three. You know me. I stay ahead of the game. All right? Love you all. Thank you so much. God bless. I'll see y'all on the next one. Much love. Oh, yeah. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Because sharing is caring. All right, let's go.